Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. For today's video I'm gonna do a Valentine's Day look using just drugstore product. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. I already primed my skin and as a primer today I use the Baby Skin by Maybelline. And this is an amazing dupe for the professional by Benefit. As a foundation today I'm gonna use the NYX Can't Stop One Stop. Uh, this is fairly new but I never tried it. I'm just gonna dot it around my face. I'm using my beauty blender and let's blend. I'm wearing foundation for the first time in two weeks because thanks to the Halo Beauty vitamins my skin is being so good it's been super clean and the past two weeks I've been wearing just concealer my hair looks fuller my skin looks better like I'm, com I'm confident enough to leave the house with no makeup at all this foundation is very pretty not as full coverage as I expected but very pretty, very natural, very lightweight I like it so I'm gonna leave the foundation working to my skin and I'm gonna move into eyebrows uh, I got this brow pencil from Wet n Wild I've never used it before so it has uh, an angle pencil which I'm not a big fan of but I really wanted to try it uh, and there, there is three colors available so finally they're stocking Wet n Wild at Boots uh, and I love their foundation so um, I got this one and the highlighter from Wet n Wild and on the other side you have a spoolie it's nice is I like the pigmentation and I'm not a big fan of the angle tape because it feels like it doesn't allow me to be as precise as when I have like like a normal tape like the NYX one for example or the Anastasia brow I like that tape because you can be very very precise but I like this one. To prime my eyelids, uh, I didn't buy anything new, so I'm gonna use my NYX primer. As a palette today, I'm gonna use this Rimmel one. This is the Crimson Edition. And I got this one because I thought it had kind of Valentine vibes um, colors. I'm gonna do something that you can actually wear on a date night not that if you want to paint a heart on your eyelids go on if that's you uh, it's just not me and I think if I'm gonna put hearts on my eyes Pablo is gonna think I completely lost my marbles it blends very nicely so what I'm trying to do is giving it a shape so I elongate my eyes I wanted it to keep it sort of like this so it creates an angle with the uh, brow and it lifts the eye. So Pavel organized the day at the spa for us for Valentine's Day. I was quite surprised because you know when you talk to your boyfriend and you always think they're not really listening. I asked to go to a spa for like months. Not ask, like I've been talking about going to a spa. I actually wanted to do it for his birthday but then we've been busy doing other things with the wedding to sort of deepen up the crease I'm gonna mix these two berry tones together oh hello that is pigment up to you how high up you want to go towards the eyebrow um, I don't mind because afterwards I'm gonna put a highlighter anyway to highlight this part and I've got quite a bit of space on my eyelid because my eyes are quite big. I'm gonna put this um, pink here and I'll try to go with my finger
these colors are very very pretty in the middle of the lid I want to try to use this gold to give a little bit of light but I'm gonna wet the brush and I'm gonna pick up this um, gold just to give a bit of extra light I don't know if you can see it on camera it gives a bit more of dimension to the eye I'm gonna finish the rest of my eye later I'm gonna fix the outer corner so I'm gonna take off the very outer edge I'm gonna go back with my sponge to put back the foundation that we took off and I'm gonna sort of blend the edges because I don't want it to be that sharp uh, I'm gonna do eyeliner I'm using the gel liner by Maybelline and I'm gonna be right back so as concealer I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and I'm gonna put a bit of extra coverage around the nose so I'm setting straight away and I'm using my Trustworthy Stay Matte by Rimmel I'm gonna finish off the under eye I'm going back into the first color that I used I keep the same brush and I'm gonna go into the deeper uh, purple that he, we used and I'm gonna focus on the outer corner and I'm gonna connect it to the upper part of the eye I'm taking this pencil this is by Cynthia Rowley and I found it on a, a birch box and I'm just gonna dot it on the outer corner I don't want too much I'm gonna set the rest of my face using the same powder lately because of this weather and my skin getting a bit dry especially when I'm out I always powder, powder the t-zone always always because that one doesn't matter how cold is outside and how dry my skin can get uh, that one at one point of the day always gets oily but I always tend to leave the rest of my face without powder and then I'll go in with the bronzer and the blush straight away for bronzer today I'm using the butter bronzer by Physician Formula a little bit across the nose on the chin And down the neck for blush I'm gonna use this bourgeois and this is in the color golden like lilac number 33 it smells like a powder that my grandma used to use oh, this is very pretty very natural I'm gonna give a first set to the face and the reason, and I'm using uh, the Pixi Makeup Fixing Mist with uh, rose water and green tea. And the reason why I do this is because I'm going to get the powder, all the powders that I put on my face to so start melting into the skin. And the highlighter is going to pop a little bit more. So pretty. Oh, it's very, very pretty. With a pencil brush, I'm putting a little bit under the brow bone. And then I'm putting just a bit on the inner corner of the eyes. Just a touch on the cupid's bow. As mascara, I'm using the L'Oreal Lash Paradise. It makes the eyelashes very fluffy. And I think, especially from Valentine's Day, it's a very pretty effect to give to the eyelashes. On my lips, I took off all the excess of uh, the foundation. I'm wearing the uh, collaboration of Kate Moss with Rimmel. And this is in the color 08.
let's give a last set to the face And that was it for today's video guys i hope you did enjoy it i hope you're gonna have an amazing valentine's day i hope you did enjoy this video do not forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell down below so you'll be notified every time i do upload a new video once a week do not forget to go and follow me on instagram my account is valid.nina87 and i'll see you again very very soon bye